the Aaron regimen, when did you actually come up with that, uh, the concept, and what is the concept? Well, the concept of my regimen basically was uh, delivered to me as a resident uh, approximately 50 years ago because in the 60s when I began my residency uh, the use of products for eczema were invariably compounded. So the, the fundamental element of being able to deliver product, appropriate product to the skin uh, has been going in, in my mind for 50 years. However, the products obviously today are more sophisticated and more effective than they uh, were all those years ago. And the Aaron regimen, can you explain it a little bit more? What are the components of it? Right. Well, thank you for that question. Uh, the key issue in atopic uh, dermatitis, certainly in the patients that are referred to me or come to me, is the presence of Staphylococcus aureus uh, infection. And consequently, in the compound that I use, I will always have a topical steroid component, which is widely used and widely understood, but the use of uh, a topical antibiotic such as Mupiracin 2%, which is the antibiotic available in the United States, is actually not widely understood or in some cases uh, misunderstood if I may be so bold. So my compounds will, will with exception contain a steroid and an antibiotic and then the vehicle to enable me to deliver or I should say the patient or the parent to deliver over the entire affected eczematous skin is an appropriate moisturizer and uh, this moisturizer varies from country to country, depending on availability. Okay. And how often do you uh, apply the compound? Well, initially, the compound is in most patients, bearing in mind that the patients who present to me are, without exception, in the most severe category of involvement. The frequency of application will be between four and six times daily. But as soon as control of the eczema has been achieved, that frequency of application will be appropriately tapered over time. And the importance of the tapering is, is that you can continue, or indeed should continue, with the cream even though the patient is better. And the beauty of the regimen is that given the dilution of the steroid, you can continue using the product even when the patient is better and even when the patient is close to or in remission because the importance of that aspect of the treatment is that will reduce the potential for flare-up because obviously the Aaron regimen effective as though it is it's not in itself a cure uh, and you do need to continue over many months with the treatment. Right and the various parts of the body do you use varying amounts of applications per day or do you apply six times per day everywhere? No the that is an, that is a very pertinent question because treatment for the eyelids, for example, and the inner genital area will vary from patient to patient, and they may need modified products or compounds from those areas. But the main compound to which I refer is usually for face, body, and limbs at a frequency which varies from patient to patient according to the severity of, of the complaint. Very good.